What I like most about acting is I get to express my feelings through the characters that I play. It's fun to make up like silly voices for make-believe characters. I'm Scarlett, I'm an actress, and I have cerebral palsy. Come on, out. The first surgery I had was on both of my eyes to correct strabismus. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. The second surgery was reconstruction of my pelvis, hips, and knees. The third surgery was to rotate my femurs and remove hardware. The fourth emergency surgery was to... What was that for? It was because one of your legs was too weak during the third surgery, and your leg broke. And my leg broke. So they had to fix it. Scarlett is if I'm allowed to say it, one of my most favorite patients. She is so sweet and so thoughtful, spunky but not obnoxious. After her first surgery, she had a lot of anxiety. She just didn't know what to expect, and so she really inspired us to think about how can we do this better. Hey Scarlett, I'm Troy. I'm one of the anesthesiology residents. Nice to meet you. Um, so, I'm gonna be one of the people helping take care of you in surgery. Uh, can you do me a favor? Can you open your mouth real wide for me and stick out your tongue? Good. When I'm talking to a child that's about to go into surgery, I think there's a few things that I really try to be cognizant of. So I like children to know where they're going to have surgery, how long it's going to take, who they're going to meet the day of surgery, uh, and then how long they're going to stay in the hospital with us. We talk about Surgery is probably going to be painful. These are the ways that we're going to take care of it. You tell us that you're in pain and we have all of these tools to make it better. You're going to meet a lot of people. They all care a lot about you and they're all here to keep you safe. I appreciate going to my appointments at UCLA Health because the doctors, the nurses, and the cleaning staff always say hi to me and they take good care of me. Dr. Thompson walks me through all the steps, like how long it will take, how many incisions I might have, how many days I'll be in the hospital for. They stay with me until I fall asleep so that I don't feel alone. And then after the surgery, they play my favorite songs, they bring me toys, they play games, and they make me feel comfortable. Any exciting upcoming plans? I have a theater performance coming up and I get to play Ursula. There's one line where I say, the tragic crowded throne will all be mine! <laughs>